people focus on like, I got to be a New York Times bestseller because they're letting their ego drive the equation. And by the way, Alicia, like I am not immune to this. I think this, when you become an author for the first time, the ego piece of it is intoxicating. Suddenly you've got exposure like you never could, you know, imagine before. But the focus on becoming a New York Times bestseller is not where you want to place your focus. It it really is about what endures and what's the message that can continue resonating and be, be meaningful to people. And that's not just a you decision, that's the business decision of why a publisher wants to get into a business with you because they see something enduring. That is exquisite. Okay, thank you. So